an astronaut. This is my rocket. And she is only 15 and she's already in commercials on the cover of magazines, all to inspire young girls to gain interest in space. Her name is Taylor Richardson and she's using life's adversity to accomplish the goals some wouldn't even dream of. Now she's sharing her story so that others would do the same. I plan to soar right to Mars because one day I will be one of the first to walk on its planet. She's a teenager speaking things into existence. Because ever since I was a little girl, I was always interested in the stars and what was beyond Earth. Taylor Richardson was inspired after reading the autobiography of Mae Jemison, the first female African-American astronaut. She dreams to someday travel to space, but just years ago, she ran into an obstacle no child should ever have to face. I've been bullied because I have ADHD, which I call abundantly different, happily divine. And I guess that kind of, people would think I couldn't do things because of that. Taylor struggled to find light in her dark time, but later found what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Because of my bullying situation, it made me want to, it turned into something bigger than that. Since then, Taylor has been on a mission to serve her community. She launched an anti-bullying campaign. She even speaks around the nation, mentors kids right here in the city, and donates books to local schools. But of all her many encounters, she says crowdfunding for kids to see a wrinkle in time and hidden figures is one of her favorites. How much money have you raised? Uh, $50,000. $50,000? $50, yes, that is amazing. You know what? I'm going to match your $50,000. <laughs> Thank you. Go. you. So many people who have helped me through this journey, so I always wanted to serve my community. With the goal of being one of the first to step foot on the red planet, in the meantime, Taylor continues to make her print right here on Earth. I hope I'll inspire a little girls, especially African-American girls, to have an interest in space and get to expose to it now so they can, when they're older, be a driven and capable smart woman to get into science, technology, engineering, and math.